end of day 78 and um, I'm 180 miles from Paris <laughs> which is uh, pretty ridiculous I've um, done about 239 miles uh, there's not many places to pull off this road so uh, yeah I'm just literally in a little parking bit outside the road so I left the coast this morning in absolutely bucketing rain. The first two, three hours was miserable, um, cold and wet. But, um, yeah, the rain's come and gone today, but uh, I've, not really, I've not really minded too much. Um, I guess there's such a transition today. I've sensed the team getting exciting, excited about the finish. There's so many conversations about the finish. Tomorrow's going to be pretty full on from the start. Um, I think GCN are joining me in the morning. I've got uh, BBC Breakfast, so you can tune in and see that in the morning. Uh, quite a lot of other media stuff going on. Um, there'll be a guy coming out so that um, on a motorbike, so they can film from the from the back of the bike going into Paris. I think there's quite a few people joining me. Some guys coming down from Koga from the bike sponsors to to ride in. It's just there's going to be tomorrow's going to be incredible, but. Um, I'm I'm not quite there yet in my head, you know. I've had to have to had such a discipline over the last uh, two and a half months that uh, I'm just struggling to let go a little bit and um, and realise that I'm now getting to that point that I've visualised, you know, probably tens of thousands of times during the journey. You know, it's always been about this final run in and what it will feel like, and there's definitely a a bit of a void between my expectation and reality at this point because I'm still just focused on the road in front of me and then yet pinching myself and going you know we're there it's basically yeah 180 miles roll in tomorrow which will mean I'll start at four as usual you know I'll try and break up the day as pla as as normal four hour sets and I should finish five six o'clock tomorrow afternoon if all goes well um so yeah amazing maybe I should be more happy at this point but there's still miles to ride and uh, this time tomorrow if all goes well It'll all be over. I'll be back with uh, Nikki and the kids. You know my mum, who's of course run base camp in Scotland for this whole expedition, like she has for all my trips. And a lot of sponsors and friends I know are already in Paris and waiting for me. So, um, yeah, brilliant. Um, it's going to be a lot of fun tomorrow. A lot of fun. But uh, it's about half past ten at night, so I'll get about four and a half hours sleep. I'll encourage the crew to get as much sleep as possible as well, because... Everyone looks a little bit cooked um, because tomorrow's going to be massive. The end of the 80 days. <laughs>